sociologically speaking, we know that meditation has a good influence on what's going on in the society and to, to reduce stress. Mm. In fact, Maharishi... Is that the Maharishi effect you're talking yes, about? Yes, that's the Maharishi effect. And Maharishi, for years, if there was a conflict in the Middle, Middle East or different places in the world, when he would send... He would actually ask teachers of meditation, other meditators, to sign up and to go and be on a, ensconced in a hotel or a group of hotels, and he would just have them meditate around the clock to ease the stress in a certain area. And I mean, he sent meditators to Washington when he thought that things were difficult in the United States and needed support. He sent meditators to Middle East. He sent them around the world to have this effect. There was a study that compared the effect of, of criminal activity during the time when that contingent of meditators was there practicing meditation, and there was a significant drop in the crime yes. rate. So if that's happening sociologically, then you have to think that when we're in our personal relationships with each other, that we're going to be bringing that same kind of effect, that, that value of awareness, that value of increased uh, sensitivity and awareness um, to our relationships. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I understand, too, that um, there's talk about an actual, I have it in my notes somewhere, but an actual ratio that they discovered, because I think they had a couple hundred yes. or thousand, it's 1% of the square root of the total number 1%. of people, was yes, that it? Exactly. Have a, um, is all you need to make an impact, which, you know, when people are saying to us, which we do, what can I do? I, I can't do anything to influence peace. I can't do anything for, you know, helping the world. You're, this is huge. Yeah. We all have a part to play. Mm -hmm. and, the, and the part that we have to play is to, is to be that peace <laughs> that we want to see in the world, mm -hmm. which is a paraphrase of what the Dal Dalai Lama says. He says, I think it is the Dalai Lama who said, be the change you wish to see in the world. Mm -hmm. and, um, and Or Gandhi, maybe. Yes. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, one or the other. Yeah. They're, they're, they're both similar. <laughs> well, <they're>, yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's what that's yeah. wonderful, and especially all the concerns people have right now: anxiety, depression, huge amounts of ADHD in the kids mm -hmm. and children, and violence and crime and fear. It seems like this addresses almost every single issue. So, if you really think about it that way, for an investment for the result, mm -hmm. then forty minutes a day is not a big deal. No, it, you know, it depends on what you, I mean. It's cheaper than uh, yes. pay, paying for medication. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you know? Well, and the other thing is, you know, it's, it's an installment. It's a, it's a contribution to, to global, to the yeah. global. And, um, to what's, what's used yeah. in quantum physics as the field, right? Right, you exactly. Know how you can influence the oneness, the field, the conceptual reality.